what's up y'all welcome or welcome back in today's video i'm going to be installing this beauty supply store wig it is a human synthetic blend it is by the company bobby boss and it is a 13 by 4 lace frontal so here i'm just showing you the inside of the cap and right here i'm going to be pinning the hair back and plucking it did come a little pre-plucked but um yeah i don't always trust that so i just did my own as you can see, I'm just going through the parts where I feel like it needs some more plucking. Um, making it a little less dense um, and just more realistic so it can be flatter. For me personally, that's how I like it. So this is a mistake that I made. I went in and sprayed it with lace tint. The lace was already dark and I probably really shouldn't have done that. And now we're going to get into the install. I'm doing my bald cap method. Um, I did speed it up a little bit just because um, this isn't the part that I really wanted to focus on. Um, I did want to focus more on how to make that brown lace lighten if you are a light skinned person such as myself. So I'm going in with my even spray and that is what I'm going to be using to put down the um, or melt down the bald cap I do not use um, got to be spray I just don't like it when I'm actually doing my bald cap method or putting down my wig so yeah here I'm just gonna be spraying it you know we all know how that goes so just spraying it around the perimeter of my hairline getting it down really good especially where my ear tabs are and I'm going to be putting oh this is going super fast with the shit it's going a little too fast for me so just watch as I apply the ball cap I'm just here cutting it <laughs> that is giving mega mine for real no I'm just kidding but my ball cap is bald y'all see that yeah yeah i did that if y'all want a video on how i do my bald cap specifically um slowing it down i'll show you how. but here i am just fitting it to my head placing it where i want it if you can see it on my face i'm looking a little disappointed because i see how dark the um lace really is compared to my skin tone so here I'm just going to be flat ironing it back. The hot comb is going to be, I'm sorry, hot combing. The hot comb is going to be your best, 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 best friend when you're doing an install. Especially with um, wigs that do come from the beauty supply store. I don't want to glue it down. I don't really like glue on my skin. So I am using the even to just lay my wig. I typically don't have them in for that long anyhow so yeah that works for me whatever works for you right and here I'm just blow drying it to melt it and here I'm just cutting the lace I did nick myself um, because yeah so I'm just cutting it and um and a zigzag i'm here stressed out praying to god so i use my translucent makeup powder and i place it all on the wig especially where there was spacing or parting where i needed um it to blend in with my skin tone now you aren't done here I'm not done I am just going in again with my hot comb and laying everything flat and here I am blending 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 you are going to want to blend so much when you are doing this and I'm just also going in with my even once again to lay the lace that is sticking up and I'm just putting down my melt band I took that off and I did record where I parted off those sections of hair, but it didn't record. But here I am again, blending, 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 um, adding a little bit more translucent powder here and there where I feel like I need to. And because it's the, the lace was so, 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 so dark, 
I really had to take my time and make sure that I really did my due diligence with spreading it. And here I am going and spreading it. As you can see, I am swiping it towards my face so that we get that really good blend effect. And here I am again with my hot comb, my bestie, and just going and laying and laying because I want to see where the powder is. I want to see that I am putting it in the proper places so that again this lace is going to melt and blend as much as possible with my skin and I'm just yeah taking my time and hot combing I didn't have any like flesh colored powder which I'm probably going to invest in but the translucent powder honestly worked really well for me um, I just took my time and also something that did not get recorded or get saved because phone storage um, I just went in again with like some concealer and put it on those places where the translucent powder was as well just to give it more of not an ashy like white tone but more blending in with my skin and here I am just showing you guys like I'm zooming in yeah it's starting to really really come together here I am again laying laying melting this is what we got to do and I'm just going in and just kind of, yeah, it got all tangled from the process, obviously, having to put my hair back and everything. So at this point, we're pretty much um, done. I just go in and cut my edges. And here we are. Here's a finished product. I did do my edges off camera because, yeah, phone storage. But... Yeah, your girl is looking laid. I'm not a professional, so please be nice. Do not come for me. Um, I am still learning. I only do my own hair when it comes to installs because I am learning. But I do hope this helped y'all and have a great day. Thank you for watching.